Hey YouTube, Atheist Vape is checking in. Today we're going to be talking about the Einiken Yukan V 2.0. Ooh, look at this sexy, sexy can. Ooh, can you imagine what you could do with this can? It's so good looking. Alright, let's try this thing out. So first off, open the bad boy up. We got a 10 milliliter capacity in this U can here. Throw in some of this affordable vaping juicy peach. You can pick up a 30 mil for $6.99. I'd say this is very reminiscent of a, a peach O. Um, nothing like a real peach, but still delicious all the same. All right, I'm going to do about half full just for demonstration purposes, but it does hold 10 milliliters. So this is a really cool uh, setup. And, you know, it's nice when you've got these, like, shitty blunt tips on your bottles to have you know uh, something that works a little bit better uh, so let's just show you a little demonstration on the you can it's got this really nice fine needle oh, got a little bit of drippage there but uh, yeah it's got a button that controls the flow of the e-juice so you can do a drop at a time just by lightly pushing it or you can let it flow by holding it down. Look at that. So if you're looking to fill up your K fun or your Thai fun, you can just hold the button down and it flows out like such. And it'll go even faster if you hold it down longer. Let's see if we can just dump it out for a little bit on something just to kind of show you what we got going on here. Oh, where, where can I put this? Just use this lid here. All right, so just to kind of give you a demo of how fast this thing drips out. So, I mean, pretty good uh, amount of drippage. And you press the button down, and again, you get uh, control drops when you just uh, push it, you know, and tap it. Um, it all gets airtight when you seal on the lid there, so you don't get any leaks, no dripping. And it seals your e-juice in there, so it actually lasts longer, because it's in an airtight seal. So it's got, it builds up like a vacuum chamber set up in there. And another cool thing about this is I've noticed with the uh, plastic bottles, you don't tend to get that last little bit of juice out there. And so you know you could get a couple more drops, but there's just, you know, it just won't drain out. This takes care of that problem. With the U-Can, the way it's set up, even when the last bits are in there and you're trying to get it out of the needle, because of the design of this thing, it will push out those last bits of juice. So it's, it's a really, really cool little setup. As you can see, the liquid gets in there, and so it pushes out every little bit. You know, the thing runs for $20 at Rose City Vapesters, so it is a little bit on the spendy side, but, you know, it's uh, stainless steel. It's going to last you forever, you know. Um, and the cool thing is, too, it's got like a little keychain holder here. So, uh, you know, you can throw it on your bag or whatever, uh, use it on the go, and you're not going to have to worry about it leaking all over the place, so... Some benefits to that. I, uh, I have a tendency to throw my um, plastic bottles in plastic bags just in case anything went wrong. I know I wouldn't have to worry about that with the UCAN V 2.0 from Einiken. So again, that holds 10 milliliters. You can pick this up at Rose City Vapesters for $20. Um, yeah, I give it a thumbs up. I'm digging it. I'm hoping maybe I'll get one for free someday. So uh, thank you much for watching. Uh, make sure to find me on Facebook.com slash The Atheist Vapist. And I'm on Twitter at Atheist Vapist. So check all those things out. I got a bunch of contests rolling. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and like my videos. Peace out, YouTube. Let's do this right. I know this has nothing to do with the dripper, but uh, you know, we can't uh, we can't change up the video formats now.